Hello there. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install a Facebook Messenger bar overlay onto your WordPress website. If we're just meeting for the very first time, my name is Gracie Ruth. I'm a social media strategist. My passion is to help entrepreneurs like yourself to have more visibility, to do social media the right way, to grow their business by having more leads, more subscribers, and more profits. So let's get on with the training. All right, we are in ManyChat.com. And in order to open an account with ManyChat, first you need to have your Facebook account open. Okay, now we go to Facebook, uh, to ManyChat, click on Get Started Free. Click on uh, the blue button to sign in. All right. So, okay, here. So we go, we're going to install um, bar at the top of our WordPress website. And we go to Growth Tools. So this is the Growth Tools. And it gives you different options here. I already created it, so I'm going to show you what I did, how I did it. So these are the different overlays. Uh, you can have a bar, you can have a sliding, you can have a modal, take, page takeover, button, box, landing page. So for this tutorial, we're going to create a bar. Okay, so it, it says allow to hide. Uh, we'll show you that later. Okay, button type. This one, this is the button, the, the bar, and it says button type, which checkbox, this one, with this checkbox or send to messenger. I like to select with checkbox and then the headline color, the text color, I like it black so it can stand out. The button color is my brand color, one of my brand colors. And then when does it display? It gives you several options. I like it to show immediately. It says show widget to the same user again after and again, it gives you several options. I select always. I always like to have that show up. Um, okay, if manual close by user show after, again, it gives you options. I select always. So we go on to the next level, which is uh, submitted state, show new message. So this is your thank you, you know, thank you confirmation, a part of the opt-in so hey thank you for your interest in the planner let's go to messenger to continue the conversation i want to engage with them and uh deliver the the pdf and you know develop a, a relationship okay one thing that i wanted to add is a space there okay click on save uh the background is my uh, background color and is my brand color so here it gives you different options and then you can type your uh, brand color code the headline in white because it'll stand out the button code it's um, white so it's it's a good um, you know it's good to the eye it's, it's not gonna be too bright or okay so the next option is the message uh, this one, this one is called growth tool number 10 opt-in. Okay. And we're going to click on edit so you can see how I created this message. So I said, awesome. First name. Uh, so right here, the, the, where it says first name is a code and this code, you can get it by clicking this little icon of this little person here. And then I am glad you decided to pick up the content marketing planner. That's what I'm offering. And then here I will send you the PDF, but first confirm. So once they click on confirm, they get an additional message. They get an addition, additional message. So it says, uh, awesome. And the name again, here's your PDF and Excel spreadsheet for you. So then the person needs to click on download now and it'll take him to the download area to download the, the freebie. And then I added um, a delay. So it looks like this message is being typed. 
So the next message is just as a reminder, anytime you want to stop getting this notification, you can type stop. You know, it's a courtesy to let them know they can, you know, they can opt out if they want. Okay, so here's a, a part of the same message. And, and that's it. So now we go back to the growth tool. We were here. We were in this part. So now the next part is the setup. We need, we want the code to put this into our WordPress website. So we're going to click on install JavaScript snippet. And right here, you need to type the names of your website. So in my case, I type www.gracyroos.com and then I type it without the W's and then I type it um, in caps also. And I should also type it in HTTPS colon forward forward um, gracyroos.com. So that way is all the bases are covered. Okay, next, this is the code that you need to install into your header, into the header PHP of your WordPress website. If you have a, a web designer, just give this code to your web designer. He or she should know what to do. So now we go to my WordPress, okay, click on finish. And now we go to my WordPress website and the code, I mean, the, the bar is at the top. So I went to the back end of my WordPress website. I'm using a Genesis theme. I click on Genesis and then I scroll down to the header scripts. So the header scripts. So I, you know, whatever was here before, I just let it stay there and then it, the previous code ends with the script and right here is where I added the code. The code that I got here. That's the code where I got it. So just install it here, save changes. And then we go to visit the website, open a new link, oh, visit it. And there it is. Create 30 days worth of social media content, get free content planner, save time and be more productive. Thanks so much for watching this video. Definitely subscribe for more beauty tutorials such as this one. If you haven't downloaded my ebook, click on the link below so you can learn more about Facebook Messenger bots, the different types of uh, growth tools, how you can grow your your leads, your subscribers, make more sales and more income. Join us in my private Facebook group, 50 Shades of Social Media, where I share more tutorials because my purpose is to help you grow your business and learn to do social media the right way. We'll see you next time.